One round in the books at the RBC Heritage. Brant Snedeker knows how to get it around Harbortown. He won the title back in 2011, and he holed out for a birdie two at 17 on Thursday. Francesco Molinari, birdie putt at the first. His 10th hole of the day, he was fighting and scratching and clawing, that got him back to even par. Graham McDowell, another former champion in the field, knows how to put the pieces of the puzzle together here. Birdie from off the surface there at the eighth to get GMAC to minus three. Xander Shoffley at the short but tricky par four ninth, drove it down there by the green. Lovely touch with the second, leading to birdie, getting Shoffley to minus two. Dustin Johnson, 110 yards away here at the 12th. Would lead to a birdie. And DJ shot himself a 68 to kick off the week. Bud Cauley, birdie putt here at the second. He was at minus three. A lot of players in that gluts around three and four under. Patrick Ketley got it to minus four when this 30-footer found the target at 12. And he was within a couple shots of the lead. Just three par fives in Harbor Town. You got to take advantage of them, as Rory Sabatini did. The Slovakian with an eagle at the second to get to minus four. Billy Horschel, very efficient opening round without a drop shot. Approach shot from 136 coming into 13 here for Billy. He got it around in 67 to kick off the week. And that's the same score that. Kevin Na would sign for as well, and his opening round was punctuated by a birdie here at the nine. Although he didn't run up there and snatch it out of there, that would have been very Kevin Na-like. But a great finish to the days. We point toward Friday's second round in Hilton Head Island, South Carolina. There's your airtimes, 7:15 Eastern kickoff for the PGA Tour Live Gang.